Arthur Pendragon, heir of Peredir. I have been watching you with keen interest. I shall allow you... We meet at last. An eternity of waiting for this single moment. Only I can grant what you require. In human power to match your legendary will. Yet, you must prove that you are worthy of this gift. Accept the trial. This is... This is the interior of my prison. Excalibur. Show me your strength. Hold nothing back. If you survive, I will deep... Excellent. You are now the master of the sword, but know that the master of your soul has yet to be decided. The contract we make today will determine much of the fate of your soul in the future. Arthur, are you familiar with this sword? Merlin certainly will be. Perhaps you need to speak with him. I knew you were the one. Only the Chosen One could pull the sword from the stone and wield it. The sight of Excalibur alone could turn many foes into followers. For Lot, however, you will need to use the blade of Excalibur and all the power within. Lot is no more just a man, but a weapon. An agent of ancient gods, wielding powers beyond mortal means. Dragon has become the master of Excalibur. Take a knee before your king, or lose your head in the name of your defiance. 
King Lot. I know a lost cause when I see one. We should live to fight another day. Excalibur in the hand of a so-called Pendragon. A blade of men held by an heir to lies cannot compare to the will of the ancient gods! Boundless power! Arthur, now that Lot has withdrawn, you must secure Camelot. Look, there lies Camelot Castle. Now, it belongs to you, Arthur. <clears throat> Your Majesty. Your people await. I ask only this. Be the Arthur I have always known. A man with a good heart and the potential to be a great hero. <laughs> <laughs> 